At 530, police have charged a man with breaking into a local funeral home. Police say he rifled through everything and he took some things. Bob Allen has details on what was stolen. The owner of Salandra Funeral Home in Cannonsburg showed a police surveillance video of an intoxicated man entering the garage through an unlocked door. Police recognized the burglar as 52 year old David Maga. He was wearing the same clothing from another video surveillance tape of him trying to break into a Cannonsburg police officer's home. Now, the owner of the funeral home says Maga loaded cleaning supplies and tools into a vehicle parked in the garage but did not drive away. Instead, he stole bottles of liquor and an American flag from a coffin. Police found those items after they got a warrant to search Maga's apartment. On the same night as the funeral home burglary, a Cannonsburg police officer caught Maga standing on his front porch claiming he was looking for his wallet. The officer told Maga to leave his property immediately. The next day, when the officer looked at his home surveillance video, he discovered that Maga tried to break in through the front and side door, turning the knob, pushing his weight on the door. David Maga faces a long list of charges from criminal trespassing, burglary, and receiving stolen property. Cannonsburg police say David Maga has a long criminal history of theft-related charges. He's now locked up in the Washington County Jail on $75,000 bond. In Cannonsburg, Bob Allen, KDKA News.